All right, so I'm out here with a couple of friends near the Cahaba River, and it is about 8.15 p.m., dusky dark. Um, that's why the camera is stuttery motion like this. It's set for a low light scene. And we're going to attempt to photograph or video synchronous fireflies. Oh, looks like they're starting up. It's about 8.20. You can see some out there. It's doing a one eighth of a second exposure. Uh -huh. Just wanted to look steadily. Well, at least you're documenting the synchronicity of them. That's good. Okay, now it's 8.30 and probably about past what this camcorder can pick up, but you can still see a few little flashes out there. Thanks, Amanda. And Jefferson County, a photographer captured a rare event that only happens for one to two weeks a year. WSFA First Alert meteorologist Tyler Seabree explains. Well, we've all heard of fireflies or lightning bugs, whichever you prefer to call them. Those insects that, uh, you know, during the twilight hours of the morning and evening, they light up green. Well, have you heard of synchronous fireflies? I saw photos courtesy of Ron Burkett on Facebook, and I had to go ahead and kind of dive into this. Look at this picture here. You see all of these little dots. That, each one of those, represents a firefly. All of them, males, lighting up at the exact same time. To get these kind of photos is extremely rare. What makes it even more incredible is that these photos, you see another one here, all lit up at the exact same time. These photos were snapped in Trustville, which is just northeast of Birmingham. So right here in Alabama, these synchronous fireflies, and when I say synchronous, I just mean they light up at the same time. These photos are extremely difficult to come across. You see this one here, there he is uh, taking the photos there. Look at all of them lit up in the background. Now, what makes this so rare? Obviously getting a photo of all these fireflies lighting up at the exact same time is difficult in itself, but this is what makes them extremely rare. They only flash like this at the same time during mating season, which is only for one to two weeks every year. So for about roughly 10 days or so, they do this synchronous lighting and they can occur in bursts, makes it really bright. And then all of a sudden it gets pitch black. Very, very cool. Again, they only happen for one to two weeks and Alabama just happens to be one of the spots in the whole world where this happens, other locations that are common include the Great Smoky Mountains and parts of South Carolina and Arizona. And yes, you can see them here if you get lucky enough, probably ending though in the next couple of days. For WSFA 12 News, I'm meteorologist Tyler Seabree. You can also catch your forecast on one of these iHeart radio stations.
You know, we've all seen lightning bugs come out in the evening, but have you ever seen synchronous fireflies? Take a look. They blink together and they respond in kind of flashing light patterns. Photographer Ron Burkett caught these synchronous fireflies in action in the Trustful area. Now, it typically happens between late May and mid June. Right now, why it happens? Well, it has something to do with flirting between the males and the females. So I'm back out here with Robin, with the fireflies on a different night. This is about a week or so after I shot the other video of the synchronous fireflies. They have pretty much done their thing now. And so, but we're back out in the same area and these are just regular fireflies. Um, they seem to be a little bit brighter and uh, stay lit a little bit longer. And I brought a different camera. This is a Canon XA11, and it has infrared uh, capabilities. It has a, an infrared emitter built in it. And when it's in infrared mode, it tends to be a little more sensitive to light in the visible spectrum as well. So I thought I'd try it to see the lightning bugs, but it doesn't appear that it's really making a whole lot of difference. But anyway, just thought I'd try.